Our roads take a beating here in Minnesota. Just this year we've seen temperatures as cold as 14 below, highs to 100 and an incredible April blizzard that dropped more than a foot of snow. All of these bring wear and tear to our roads. For the past five years, scientists at Cargill have been working on a new type of pavement that uses less raw materials like aggregate and oils and is designed to be more durable. We're looking at increasing the recycled content in the pavement. So traditionally, pavement has about 30% recycled content, and today the trial we're working on will incorporate 45% recycled content. Along this stretch of Excelsior Boulevard in Hopkins, 4.8 miles of road is being paved. One side with a traditional method, the other side the new way. By using more recycled material, that's less raw material that you have to bring in, you have to um, truck in less material, and so by incorporating recycled material then you can save money on uh, transportation and also on the raw material costs. How much less material? For this project it was six fewer dump trucks. And scientists at Cargill say that this road will last longer too. You can actually get pavement that uh, is more durable and can last longer and can perform better than the more conventional lower recycled uh, pavements that are made. Cargill researchers expect this new recipe of blacktop to be more resistant to potholes and cracking. In Hopkins, I'm Jeff Edmondson, CARE 11.